I listen to metal. I grew up with metal. I've done everything that I possibly could. That's why I feel like that it's time to see what the rest of the world has to offer in other genres as well. My name is Aaron, and I grew up as a metalhead. Well, 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 welcome back, everybody. We are returning to some EXO content, and that is because Kyung Su is absolutely got a new song out, so you know I had to check it out. Some Dio. <laughs> I'm actually pretty excited because it's been a hot, hot minute since we've had some EXO on the channel. So anyway, let's uh, let's check it out, what, what he has in store for us. It, most of his solo stuff has been some of my favorites, so it's super sick. Sorry, my popcorn. <laughs> Beautiful. <laughs> I love his logo. Awesome. Okay. I have a few thoughts. <laughs> first and foremost, the first thing that I'd like to talk about is because, you know, I play a little bit of that guitar, the old get box. Yeah, of course, that's the first thing that I noticed. <laughs> One thing that I've always loved about Dio specifically is just the fact that he, to me, he's the king of simplicity. And 
he's very just got such nice topics and i feel like that it's kind of that same feeling that i get when uh you know when i listen to some music and it's just like okay like listen to the topic that they have listen to the theme and just the fact that they're able to kind of make that special and it just comes across so great to be able to make something that's ordinary seem and feel so important the the other thing that i have to say that i really really appreciate about it all too is just the fact is is that he's always so calm (laughs) to me that's like the thing right is that he's just so calm he's just so you know good at just being carefree to me he's kind of like the carefree king and i just i don't know it's so it's so gorgeous (laughs) it's so gorgeous i just i think that it's something that he just really excels with the other thing that I feel like that he just does really well with this song particularly is just the fact that uh, there is a nice escalation without a tense feeling behind it. It's still just kind of like a, feels more like a progression rather than a feeling of uh, like <gasps> apprehension, if that makes sense. <laughs> I think this part of this video absolutely is just like exactly what i was just talking about that capsulation of just carefree feeling that he provides i just i don't know i really just like how he wrote the song it's just this it kind of feels like it's you know the simple things in life kind of deal you know (laughs) Uh, it's so good uh, I, I definitely feel like that there is a, uh, there is a bit of a swing coming with EXO, right? I feel like that there's quite a bit of, uh, of that feel and that, I don't know, maybe a little bit of momentum of a return. I don't know. I really like the fact that he started his own company. I've been kind of monitoring that for a little bit. I think that that's going to end up becoming a very pot, a uh, very positive thing for not just him, but all of XO moving forward. And so I think that it's just really cool. But yeah, let me know what y'all think about this song down in the comments below, and we shall return to more XO. Have a good one.